Boys and girls, today we're going to look at the number sentence. Jerome wrote the number sentence below. 4 times 8 equals 8 times what number? This is called the commutative property of multiplication. And what that means is the order of the numbers in a multiplication problem does not matter. So you need to have the same numbers, but the order you write them in does not matter. And let's also remember the equal sign means it must be the same amount on both sides. So we should all know 4 times 8 is 32. A quick way to do that, I do it in my head, 8 and 8 is 16, 16 and 16 is 32. That's so easy for me. You can, any way you can memorize the multiplication tables is fine. So we have to have this side equal 32. So we really need the two same numbers, because once again, the commutative property of multiplication says the order of the numbers does not matter. We're going to get the same answer. So what number is missing? I have a 4 and I have an 8. On this side of the equal equation, I only have an 8. So the number that is missing is 4, and therefore the correct answer is A, 4.